crikey, 20 years, it seems gone like that. It's gone very, very quickly. But um, no, I, I think it's not only the, the tournament. It was just a great period of my life. You know, I had sort of seven years coaching the team, obviously culminating that great night in Sydney in, in 2003. And I remember going into that game, the, the kind of the, 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 the theme for the whole week was, if everyone does their job properly, we, sh we should win this game. And that was for every player, coach, everyone involved in the whole squad. And on the night, we, we, we played okay, but I think looking back, we didn't sort of set the world alight, but I never thought we were going to lose, lose a game. And, you know, I can honestly say everyone did their job properly. You know, I'd also look, look, back, look back at my role in it in terms of making subs or not making subs. I mean, I made very few subs, and considering we went into overtime, I think of the final whistle was still four subs on the bench, which is unheard of today. And I just remember it being this massive relief, to be honest, because, you know, we were favourites to win. We're number one ranked team in the world. We'd be in Australia, home and away regularly. I can honestly say from, you know, from Martin Johnson down, the players, everyone involved with the team did their job properly and we, we won the game. Nick Bar jones Francois Pena, John Eels, and now Martin Johnson. Same thing, we always should have a big um, board with just three key points on. You know, and, and the last point was, everyone do their job properly, we'll win this game. So the real thing is everyone just stay really calm, think about your job. We know then when we're kicking off or receiving, and you know your job, everyone do their job, probably win the game. We knew we were a good team, we knew that it was a very stable team, there was, you know, it was our strongest team I was putting out, and that was our statement, do our job probably, we'll we, we win this game. And, you know, Jono was fantastic, because he kept repeating as well, do your job properly, win the game. Jason Robinson, undoubtedly, he made such a massive difference. I mean, I had incredible players. But when Jason came in for rugby league, he, he literally, including me, took us all to a new level. He was such a professional, and when I say professional, in a really right way. His, 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 his fitness, his levels, his demand, he, his skill training, his footwork drills he did was just fantastic. And he was just a superstar player. There's, there's, there's no doubt he took the team to a new level. It's one of the, the things I'm most proud of achieving is getting him to switch from rugby league to rugby, rugby union. You just put him anywhere where the ball's going to be. That was his role with England. I think we had to we had to start on the winger and start on the fullback. But his role, wherever the ball was, Jason, you go and find it. Jason My first game for England was uh, in, a, in, a, in the Grand Slam team in 1980. I remember then, certainly the, the ball was heavier. I actually wanted to play fly half. I mean, that was my best position. That's why I played in the schoolboy rugby. So I kicked the ball a lot, and I was a good goal kicker, a good, good kicker out of hand. But I remember the balls were fundamentally that bit heavier, and also that bit smaller, but more pointed. So when the early, early 90s came in, from a coaching point of view, the kicking game became really important. So yeah, they were a lot easier to pass the ball, but the kicking game became really important. Not just goal kicking through Johnny, but kicking for all the players, especially the backs, when you're trying to do cross-field kicks or kick to score. And the synthetic ball made the kicking a lot easier and a lot more accurate. But I just remember it just it was a better game big for the synthetic ball. I think Gilbert took the whole thing to a whole new level because you could kick and pass the ball a lot better, more accurate and became a much better ball to play.